not a whole lot left. So I remember looking at, we call it a PAL, it's a product lineup. I remember looking at it like on Wednesday, because I was off on Thursday, and I'm like, oh, a really great bag yes. from Vince Camuto. Woohoo! And then uh, the update came and it said a very quick show and mention yep. because it's almost sold out. So it's our big deal. It's like a today's special value, a sister to the today's special value. Look at the mush. Mm -hmm. I mean, this is the best leather. And last year, Courtney, I got a great tote from Vince Camuto. I wore it constantly. I really wasn't switching out my bag because I had the honor of meeting him and he was so cool and he was such a great designer and his legacy lives on in his shoes, his clothing and his handbags. Um, this ships for free. This price is going up in a couple days if it lasts because we are so limited and we started in Fashions Night in with 2000. You want to hear what we have left? So why don't we start in the should we do the noir? Should we go for the black? OK. We have six dozen left in the noir. That's it. Now this one is called Matador, right? The red. We have a dozen left. So pretty. So cool. My mother always used to say every woman needs a great red bag. We have it in elderberry, which I'm holding, which is very similar to the one I owned, which wait, I bought on clearance and it was more than this from QVC. <laughs> so we only have 150 in the elderberry. In the middle, if you want that neutral shade that Courtney has, it's called cashmere. I'm so predictable. Very elegant. I love the zippers on the side. Only six dozen left. And then this one is thundercloud in the gray, 120. And I love the way the Vince Camuto designers, because this is something I look for. And I think, Courtney, we all do. We love those little touches that like on the black uh -huh. and on the elderberry, the gunmetal material is used um, and even on the thundercloud but then on the cashmere and on the matador it's a little bit of a brighter silver and this one is only it weighs a pound and a few ounces so load it up and then it's 16 by 13 inches with a, a gusset of almost six so just a great bag i think it's so cool how vince camuto too color. like what luxury handbag designer that i i, I can't think of another one um that will listen to the customer and make changes the way Vince Camuto does with their handbags. Right. This particular silhouette, this tote, has been a really famous one here. But every time they bring you a value of the day, they listen to feedback and they like make it a little right. bit better. Right. So this is like the culmination of of how can we make already a famous bag even better? And that's what you can feel when you look at the like the the shoulder when you feel it. I love the convertibility I of slimming the bag down because Courtney and I are two women like you probably that put a lot of stuff in our bag but yep. sometimes maybe we don't or we want it to look a little bit more streamlined on the arm when we walk into a restaurant but yep. then when everybody's handing you stuff to hold or yeah. you know it's you know you're going to a store and you're like no thanks I really don't want a plastic bag let me just put it in here you've got your little snap closure in the front and that's going to be big enough to hold look how strong that snap is too that's going to be big enough to hold maybe your um, smaller or your bigger tablet or even a smaller laptop and then on the inside you've got your zip compartment and the pockets on either side but the leather is so lovely it literally puddles we don't have many left and we don't have much time left at this price so we have the black noir five dozen we have elderberry which is very similar to the one i bought on clearance which was more than this 125. we got the cashmere four dozen and then we have thundercloud fewer than 100 and the color that you may see just sold out so get this while we have it as we only have about gosh an hour and eight minutes courtney left on our one-time only values an hour and eight minutes left in our one-time only values this a Kim Gravel takeover. Court, are you on tomorrow night? I am, but Kim's show is right. We, I well, have to do, we're we're doing um, Sean Saves Christmas. Oh, yeah. What time does that start? Uh, Nine o'clock. Okay, so I'm on till